Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Toria Bonita. Welcome, welcome. Don't forget to like and subscribe, please. Alrighty. Um, so today we are diving straight into five days of she in tweed. That means your girl bought five tweed items from Shein to wear throughout the whole week. I like to separate them into different categories, but you know what? Let's jump in. Alrighty guys, um, so the rules for this, my five day challenge, um, is to get one item or one outfit or one, one item for tweed, but sometimes it's one outfit, sometimes it's accessories, sometimes it's different stores. Um, so one outfit for five different looks. Uh, we have day one, which is like a work look. Day two, which is like a day date or date day. Day three, which is like a night date. So, you know, day two is like cute and <laughs> going on your day date, casual, cute. Um, Day three is a night date, so you might want to like look a little bit like um, more not sexier because I, I don't dress sexy, but like you know, a little bit more chic, we'll say. Um, day four is running errands, so you're really like on the go, low key, you know, that kind of stuff. And then day five, we have my style, so. Yes, everything is my style because I buy it for me, but I buy them for specific things. If it was just my everyday, like, you know, my everyday life, like, what is truly my style? That's the last day, day five. I call it my day or myself, me day. Um, and so, yeah, so let's go ahead and jump in. Jumping in to day number one, this is work so currently for work I work from home um, so I don't really have to get dressed up I used to have to wear all black and so when that was the case I was like okay I'm just gonna get a tweed backpack and maybe a headband which I did but then I felt like that was kind of cheating because there are people who go into the office or you know might have to soon I don't know there's people who have to get dressed up business casual so uh, what I got was this first one, which is this blazer. So it's like, it's like double breasted, right? That's what it's called when it has two buttons. It's a uh, size three X. It feels a little scratchy, so I'll probably have to wear like a long sleeve under it. It's kind of long. It almost looks like a men's blazer in a sense. Um, but the buttons are really nice. I love the collar. The back has like some. Um, what is it called? Pinning, I think. I don't know. I'm not like a fashion, like, I love to buy fashion, I love to get dressed up, but I'm not like a fashionista, I guess. But I think this is called pinning or something, and it's just a type of stitching that like gives a little bit of formation to your like jackets in the back, especially like around your caboose. So cute. The pockets are fake, which is boo, but so cute. I could see me wearing this over like a thin turtleneck or whatnot, you know, something cute like that. Alrighty, and so for jumping into day number two, we are going out for date day. So date day, um, you know, I like to be a little bit casual, a little bit cute, but casual all at the same time. So for date day, very similar, actually almost the same as the blazer, we have this vest here. So this vest has gold details. As you can see, again, the pockets are faux, even on the bottom, even on the bottom. But it does have a really pretty, um, unfinished we'll say unfinished this is also in a 3x it looks a little big but that's okay so what I plan to wear this over is like some knee-high boots 
um, like a long sleeve, maybe a turtleneck, and then like some leggings, of course. And I think that would just look so cute. And then I have like my leather coat to go over it if it's cold out. <laughs> And then if we're going on date night, we want to get a little bit more like, um, you know, like, how can I say it? Sexy cute, we'll say. Like you still want to, I still like to be cute because I'm cute. I know I'm not like, like, I, you know, I'm cute. We'll just leave it at that. So what I got was this Tweed Hound's Tooth. Hound's Tooth is becoming one of my favorite prints. Um, and it's this skirt here. So again, I can wear it with tights. I'll probably wear it with leggings because it's cold out with some like knee high boots and a little top and like, you know, a black shirt tucked into it. It's like one of those waistband type tops, which is cool with like a belt. So, so cute. And it is a tweed material, but it's thicker than the other ones which makes me feel like they do have different quality of tweeds on there. This is in a size 4X. I don't know if this is gonna fit me or be too big, but we will definitely find out together. Alrighty guys, so it is day number four. We are running errands and I wanted something tweed but with red because I like wearing like my red sneakers with leggings and like a sweatshirt. It's like I don't know if it's like a SF thing. I don't know, but I love it. I've always done it since we were younger. And so what I got was this thing here. Look at this. It's a sweatshirt, right? It's not finished at the bottom. It's frailed, at the, frilled, frilled, frailed. But it is a turtleneck, so it'll keep me nice and warm. I do have to wear a shirt under it because it doesn't have lining underneath, but it is so warm, so heavy, and super thick. This is in a size 4X, so this is a little oversized, perfect for those leggings. So I'll probably grab my sneakers to wear with these. I do have my white sneakers, so I can wear those. Um, we'll figure it out though, but it feels itchy. I haven't tried any of these on yet, so I don't know how they feel on, but when I do, you'll definitely know. <laughs> Alrighty guys, and then we have day number five. Um, day number five is the me day. So it's the thing that spoke to me most, we'll say, um, when I was shopping for these items. And this definitely did. I think it's cute. It's that like, kind of like classy type of look, but then it's also relaxed in a sense. And it is this sweatshirt here. This sweatshirt, I don't know about you, but this sweatshirt is me to a T. The sleeve is tweed, it has tweed ruffle, tweed real pocket right here. And, and then it's a gray sweatshirt. It's in a size 3X. Look at this, it's so cute. I've been waiting for this video to wear this and I've had this for some time. Can't wait. I think this is so me. I could have put this for the errands, but this is so me. And this one is the whole reason for this video. I was like, mm, this is the me day. I can't wait to wear this, guys. Alrighty guys, so you saw final montage. We are here for final review. It has been a few weeks since I filmed that first part of the video. And I just wanted to say that I loved pretty much all of the pieces. The only one that I had some kind of issue with was the red, the running errands, the red sweater. And the only reason is because it was a little tight even though it was like a 4x because i wanted it looser it wasn't loose it was 
kind of tight no stretch i love the neck and the sleeves but the and the color is beautiful but the fit was not my cup of tea my favorite outfit is the skirt outfit um which was the houndstooth and i just love the way the skirt fit except for before i even put the skirt on one of the buttons came off so i used the safety pin that's where you see a little bit of buckling but i used the safety pin to hold it together so you can't see my chones even though i had leggings on underneath but that was my favorite favorite piece i'm gonna try to get the button put back on um eventually and um yeah the other pieces the vest was beautiful i'll wear it it does shed quite a bit so that was my only gripe with that one the blazer was beautiful i'll wear the blazer definitely will wear the blazer um and then the sweatshirt at the end i it was so comfortable i just lounged all day in it so yes i love that sweatshirt but the skirt i wonder if i could put the skirt and the sweatshirt together that would be cute, right? We'll have to try it one day. Um, yeah. So this is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this five day of She in Tweed. Um, I really enjoyed trying Tweed. It's actually more comfortable than I thought it was going to be, except for the one. Um, and yeah, I loved it. Um, I hope you guys liked. I hope you guys subscribed. I hope you guys leave a comment down below with what you want to see. Um, and then starting March 1st, March 1st, we're going to start having videos every other Monday. So every Friday and every other Monday because I have so many ideas and concepts for videos that I'm going to add in every other Monday plus every Friday. So... Um, so that's starting March 1st. So we'll go March 1st, you get a video, then that Friday, then the next Friday, then the next month. You know what I mean. Yes. And um, starting in April, I think we'll jump back and forth between wedding updates and like home renovation updates. You know, um, I do know that his passport will be here shortly. So we should be able to start doing the courthouse shortly yes but i will see you guys in monday's video because this is the end of february so i will see you in monday's video and then fridays i love you guys so so much i love you guys so so much and i'll see you guys in next in the next video ta-ta